In this lesson, you'll discover how to paint birds in watercolor. Here is the finished watercolor artwork that we will achieve by the end of this lesson. The inspiration for this artwork is taken from Venice, Italy, where you can find a lot of seagulls that nest along the canals, of which there are plenty in this city. Here is one such bird resting on the wooden pole. Let's begin with transferring the drawing onto the watercolour paper. This drawing has been made on tracing paper, which is fixed in place with masking tape. Graphite pencil marks are on the reverse side of the tracing paper. For the first wash, I will be using a Princeton Neptune Round Synthetic Swirl Brush, number 8. Since I am making a variegated wash, instead of using just one mixed colour, I will introduce several colours into this wash, such as blue and green. I didn't use any masking fluid to mask the bird. Instead, I am going around the bird, leaving its silhouette untouched. While the paper is still wet, I can wipe off paint with the Aqua Elite Synthetic Kalinsky brush, which holds its shape very well, and does the job perfectly. Wiping off produces softer edges than with the masking technique. I now want to make a second coat wet into wet. Therefore, I apply clean water first using the flat wash brush. The area inside the arch is in shadow. That is why I apply darker tones in this area. The reflected light from the ground has a warmer colour, so I add earth pigments into the variegated wash. I am using a Princeton Synthetic Squirrel brush, which holds and releases paint very well. I will show you once again the finished artwork, just to demonstrate that such effects are simply not obtainable in one layer of paint.